to pick up a tent for trade shows let's go it's gonna be badass it's not even really for trade shows i just made some banners and shit like that designed them up and uh i bought like a well we have like a 10 by 10 uh tent so i'm just gonna set that up set the banners up hopefully it'll be sweet we made it safely time to get some banners But we just made a little quick stop here at Car Nova. This place is pretty badass. It's like an all indoor um, dealership. Uh, we're actually wrapping this kid's car. And uh, check this out. Badass. All these cars up in here. Pretty sweet. But we're gonna get back to the shop. Um, throw these banners up, make sure they look good. Um, hopefully everybody likes them for this car show, so. I gotta do something to fix this. So my original idea was to do like wire and hang the banner on that, but it's not really working out, obviously. Um, and then the back one, I think that one's pretty much gonna work. I just need to throw some more grommets up in the spots where I marked so I can just go like that. And I think that'll work. But I think I'm gonna go get some PVC for these and do like a 10 foot PVC uh, pipe up top here, one down on the bottom and one over here. <laughs> and hopefully that sturdy is it sturdy. I'm gonna zip tie it to that, the, P the PVC. And hopefully that kind of stabilizes this one a little bit better. All right, so here is the end product for the DIY banner tent deal thing. Hey. So what I did, um, the banner itself just wasn't working out. So I built like these little PVC frames. I think I had like 30 bucks in the both sides. So nothing too crazy. Um, it was just a couple uh, 90 degrees. And I think there's four, there's four 90s. And then there's two T's right here in the middle. And uh, worked out pretty good. And then this one, I just threw some more grommets in up top on the bottom works out could use a little bit of work but maybe a couple more zip ties other than that it looks pretty good and the car just fits just fits in here beautiful check it gorgeous what's going on guys so i just want to kind of go over like the numbers on how much it cost me to make this little diy um, trade show 10 by 10 tent. Um, so basically, I have it all written down here. Um, so, and the banners, I had a 9.8 foot by 6.6 .6 foot banner. And uh, I worked all that out in inches before I converted it to feet, but that's just what I had. Um, that one came up to 65 square foot. Um, that one would have cost me usually if I went to like a local sign shop They usually charge me about six dollars a square foot for a banner um, So I just figured 390 bucks is what they would have charged me um, For that banner and that was like the back wall. That was a big banner and then for the sides I did um, 118 inches by 30 inches. So two and a half feet tall by 9.8 again and I got for uh, just a rough square footage, uh, 25 square foot. It was shooting a little high, but that's pretty much real close. Um, I got $150 for those. Um, then pretty much times that by two, because there's two. Um, and then that, that guy got obviously 300 bucks. Um, so all in all, I, in banners, I had um, $690 altogether. And that was for both sides and the rear wall. For PVC, I had um, 
eight 90 degree angles. I had four tees and I had six 10 foot sections of half inch um, PVC. I went to Home Depot and got all that for 35 bucks. For the tent, if you don't have it easy up already, um, I think they're like 150 bucks online. Um, to com in comparison to like going and actually buying like an actual trade show tent, um, I have one behind me um, with pretty much the same um, options that I just uh, DIY'd basically, only mine wasn't printed at the top. Um, kinda wish it was, but you know, is what it is. And uh, it got the job done, so whatever. But this one's got the back wall in it and it has half, half sides. Um, their back wall option was $480, about the same size banner as mine. Um, their, their sidewalls are a little bit taller. They're charging 200 bucks for those. And um, overall, the entire price on the tent printed with the top, um, rear wall, two sides, is $1,979.99, almost $2,000 for that tent. Um, I mean, it's pretty badass looking, but I don't know if I wanna spend two grand and a tent that I'm gonna use four or five different times a year. It's not really making me a whole lot of money, um, but whatever, you know, if you got the money, go for it. Um, this was just a quick little DIY that I put together. So yeah, whatever. If you guys enjoy these videos, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. We'll see you guys later.